Hey everybody, it's Holly from Baby Gizmo, and today we're taking a look at the Evenflow Pivot Travel System. Now this travel system comes with the Pivot Modular Stroller that can become a pram, a travel system, or a toddler stroller, and it also comes with the Evenflow SafeMax Infant Car Seat. So let's take a look. Now let's start with the Pivot Stroller. Now, first of all, it comes with this little foot muff cover, which I think is fantastic. Now the stroller does come in a variety of different colors. This one is sandstone, it's like a taupe color, so we're gonna go ahead and take that off to show you the seat. So right now I have it in toddler mode. It accommodates up to 50 pounds. It measures 12 inches wide with a 17 inch seat back and a measurement from the back of the seat to the top of the canopy up here of 23 inches. It has a adjustable padded five point harness. The harness buckle is very easy to do. You just push the button and it pops right open. There is a bumper bar here and I love that the bumper bar has this removable little snack tray for the baby. So when you have it in the pram mode, you could take this off or if you need to clean it. And if the baby's in the chair, you can just go ahead and pop it on there. Now this is a removable but not swing away baby bumper bar. So it doesn't swing away, but it does remove very easily. Now down here, you don't have an adjustable foot rest right here, it doesn't go up and down, but I love that this fabric right here, it's kind of a rubberized fabric and it's really easy to clean, so that's where their feet and shoes are gonna go. Now let's go ahead and turn it into a pram. Now turning it into a pram is very, very easy. The seat transforms to your bassinet. There's a one-handed lever on the back here. You go all the way back like that. Then there's a buckle right underneath the seat. You just unbuckle that and it falls down into a pram bassinet environment, carry cot, however you'd like to say it. I would go ahead and take the snack tray off and then go ahead and put the bumper bar on there because that'll be easy to grab the carry cot like that. Now, what I love about this is not only does it go up and down for when you turn it into a toddler seat, but you can also recline the back of the pram portion. So if your child has reflux or you need to incline it at all a little bit, it can go from flat and then you just use this strap system here and that has an incline in your bassinet environment. Now you have a five point harness in the seat. You cannot remove that. So you're going to buckle your baby in even in the bassinet mode, which I don't think is a bad thing at all. You can also reverse the pram and this is how most people use it use a bassinet stroller pram like this is when it, the child is facing the parent. So right there you have child facing the parent or they could face out. There's a nice big canopy on it. Um, so I really like the pram feature. Now that you've seen the pram option for the pivot, let's go ahead and turn it into a toddler seat. Now it's very easy. All you have to do is go ahead and lift that same lever. You're gonna put it upright. Underneath the seat, there is a buckle, and that same buckle that we undid, we're just gonna go ahead and buckle it again. And that's gonna bring it up to make the place for their feet like that. And there you go, there's your toddler seat. Now, the same thing, you can recline the toddler seat and it's gonna keep its V shape like that. Or you can go ahead and use the strap system like this, squeeze, and just the back of the seat will go back. So you have two different ways to recline the child and it can go all the way flat when you do it like this. So you can use it from birth up to 50 pounds. Now the handlebar, it's a foam covered handlebar. It is not adjustable. It is 40 inches from the ground to where I place my hands. So while it is taller, if you are a super tall parent, you might want to check it out first. On the side, this is a parent cup holder that is included. You could remove it if you wanted, but it does stay put pretty well even when you fold the stroller. Now the canopy, I like the canopy. It's a large three panel canopy. There's a large peekaboo window here. It's mesh, so it allows air to circulate through the seat. It is does not have any Velcro or magnetic closures, so it's just gonna kinda lay there um, to cover it, or you can open it and set it back like that. So I think it is a good full coverage canopy. I would love to see an additional pop-out sun visor just so it can go all the way to the baby bumper bar, just for extra sun coverage, but I still think it is rather large. So let's go to the bottom of the stroller. The basket on the pivot is absolutely huge. You can fit big, huge diaper bags, backpacks, blankets, jackets, whatever you need to take with your kids. I have a Jujube B Classy. Easily fits with room to spare. I can even add an additional diaper bag. This is the BFF by Jujube. That fits and there's still room. So twins, triplets, multiple kids, you're gonna fit a ton of things in this basket with no problem. Plus, the access to the basket is great. I can easily access it from the back or the front. 
Now the wheels on the Pivot, these are smooth surface wheels. It was not designed to be an all-terrain stroller, and so they are smooth surface wheels. The back ones are nine inches, the front ones are seven inches. Like I said, they're very smooth wheels. It's kind of like a hard rubber. I'm not really sure what they're gonna call this, but it's um, like a hard rubber, so they should be great on smooth surfaces. The back wheels have individual brakes. You need to step down on these pedals individually on each one, and that will lock each wheel into place. Now, the front wheels. These are swivel wheels. These wheels in the front, they have no ability to lock straight for a little bit of mommy terrain. So that's again why I say it's not an all-terrain stroller. They are 360 degree swivel at all times. So those are the front wheels. Now the Pivot Travel System comes with the Even Flow Safe Max Infant Car Seat and the base. Now I love that the base has an anti-rebound bar to prevent this, the forward motion in event of a crash. So I love that safety feature. I love the fabric on the car seat. The car seat has like a microfiber. It's really, really soft, really, really nice to, to, to the touch. There's also an infant insert in the seat that could be removed as the baby gets older. The infant seats works from four pounds all the way up to 35 pounds. It has a, har a harness that you can adjust. It's not a no rethread harness. You do need to rethread it, but it's a nice secure harness. It has a large canopy up here. Um, it goes all the way a little bit past the handle, um, which is nice. And I have it right now on the base. Let me go ahead and show you. There is the Safe Max. It is super light, like really, really light. It's not going to weigh you down even with a baby in the seat. So I love that it's so lightweight and I love that it comes with the base with um, the anti-rebound bar. Now, you're going to turn into a travel system and there's no additional adapters needed. You're just going to go ahead and pop off your toddler seat. Take your infant car seat and it goes in the same exact places, snaps in like that. Again, no additional adapters needed, which I think is fantastic. The car seat can face parent or face out of the world. I do know most parents do like to have the baby face them when they're in the infant car seat. So really, really easy. There's a lever on the back. You lift like that and that pops it out. Then you can put it into the car. So it makes it easy from going from car to stroller when you're out and about. Now let me show you how to fold the pivot. It's super, super easy. I'm gonna go ahead and lock both the rear wheels into place because that's gonna give me the easiest standing fold. There's two levers right here. If you lift those up, it folds down like that, locks into place, and has a standing fold, and I didn't even have to bend over. It's super light, it's about 20 pounds, really easy to get in and out of your trunk, which I love. I love the standing fold. And then when you unfold it, you just go ahead and unlock that automatic lock, Lift up on the handle and you are ready to go. Now, the Evenflow Pivot has some fantastic features, but you're wondering how much it's gonna cost, right? A modular stroller with an infant car seat? Well, this one is budget friendly at under $300. It retails for about $280, depending on where you get it. Comes in a variety of different colors. So I really, really like it. This is giving parents that option to have the reversible seat, the pram option, the travel system option, and the infant car seat for all for under $300. That is fantastic. So that's it for me. Leave me a comment. What was your favorite feature of the Evenflow Pivot? Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thumbs up this video if you want to see more Baby Gear videos. And that's it. I will talk to you later. I'm Holly from Baby Gizmo. Bye, guys.